Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Claudia's Lovely Nails. Hi guys, what's up? Today I thought I would go ahead and hop onto this cute trend I've seen, and it's a cow print nails. And honestly, these are really cute and quite easy to do. So if you're a beginner like me, then this is something we can both definitely do. So first off, as you see, I'm going to mix white with just a tiny dash of pink. I don't want my white base to be entirely plain pure white. I just want a tiny little dash, a little pink in there. Cow prints are pretty much different shapes and sizes, so really, there is no wrong design here. And if you mess up, then it's totally fine. You can fix it with a little bit of acetone or creating a bigger cow design. Because, you know, really, it won't matter since the rest of your nails will have different shapes and sizes. So you can just go on off with what you messed up on and just make a big white cow print, really. Alright, so I think, you know, I think having plain cow nails is pretty basic, but if you like them as is, then by all means, you can keep them like this. However, I'm going to add black crisp smile lines. I'm going to use this nail as a guy. I will be making dots, that way I can easily trace the dots and form a seamless crisp smile line. Also, it's a way for me to know how far I want the line to go. Add the top coat on top yes uh, on top it goes on top because that's why it's called the top coat <laughs> anyway this will basically be the same design for the rest of the nails however for my ring finger just to make it pop a little bit I'm going to use a different nail shape an almond shape instead of a black crisp smile line I'm going to use a hot pink color I'm starting with this step first so I can avoid the base color to bleed through. And speaking of the base color, it won't be a white base. <laughs> 
it's going to be a black base. That is something completely different. And now that I think about it, I don't think I've ever seen a black cow with white prints. Fun fact, I used to live in a farm that had two cows and they are quite lovely creatures, I must say. One was so sweet and the other, well, wasn't quite so sweet. But you know what? This video is dedicated to them. Chocolate and Vanilla. Yep, that was their names. Any hoosie, I'm carefully brushing on the black base. And the smile line is quite delicate. One wrong move and I can bleed the black into the pink and I really don't want to remove it with acetone. Alright, so now comes in the white cap prints and again, the shape and size don't matter. I actually was referring to some cow images on Google. You can do it too if that helps you. I know it did for me because I don't really remember how cow prints look. But anyways, alright, after applying the top coat, I'm going to prep my nails by buffing them. So what this does... What this does, according to some research that I did, is that it removes oils. That way it can have a better grip onto the nails I'm about to apply. Okay, I think we're ready for the reveal and... Okay. Okay, I think we're ready for the reveal and... Ta-da! Aren't they gorgeous? Oh my goodness, they're so adorable. Didn't I tell you that the nail on my ring finger just gives it that pop anyways guys that's it hope you guys enjoyed this look as much as i did let me know down below what you guys think thank you guys so much for watching and marbles don't you think that they should subscribe to my channel and turn on post notifications so that they're notified when i post a new video <laughs> you see guys he agrees thanks again and stay tuned for my next video